what, what the mate is talking about. Yeah. What's up, family? A young man is dead after reportedly drowning in Tunica County, Mississippi. Backstory. This guy is at an apartment complex. In the middle of the apartment complex is a large pond. He's having a conversation with several people around him, including his brother, who dared him to swim across the pond. The guy has some trepidation about doing it after asking several questions like, you know, what kind of car are you going to get me? Because the brother promised him a car, a new car, if he swim in the pond. He asked, what kind of car are you going to get me? And then he asked, you know, what was the wager? Somebody said $20 and, you know, the dude also said, you know, if I drown, who's going to save me? His brother was like, I'll jump in and save you. Man, dude looked around, thought about it for a while, and he jumped in. About midway through, they're accusing him of actually walking instead of swimming, walking on the bottom. And somebody warned, yeah, about in the middle of the pond, it drops. There's a huge drop. And sure enough, when he got about in the middle of the pond, it dropped and he disappeared. Somebody called 911. They came out and they found his body. It took every bit of six minutes. And they pulled him out dead at 19 years old, a seven month old son set to graduate next month from high school. I know that these are silly games that young people play and oftentimes young people just don't think that far. I know we play silly games like that. Hell, I played those games when I was in my 20s. I remember doing something like that with Bushwick. Me and I bet Bill that he wouldn't jump off the, uh, what bridge was, it, was that? Um, we were in a limo riding on the bridge and San Francisco Bridge. Uh, what do they call that bridge? Whatever. I bet Bill that he wouldn't jump off of it. <laughs> Bill said, stop the limo. Jumped out. And he was actually about to do it. I bet him $10,000. And Jay was like, yo, man, don't do that shit. Jay stopped Bill from jumping off the bridge. He was going to do it. I thought it was funny at the time. Of course, I'm young. You know, I don't know no damn better, you know, like. And I'm not really thinking that it's going to kill him anyway. You know, I'm thinking, well, if you, if you can swim, you know, it's just a dive. Especially when, you know, when you watch those Olympics and stuff and you see people jumping, you know, diving, you think, well, shit, you know, it'll look about the same distance or so. But, of course, that drop is a lot steeper. But anyway, had the same bet with Reddy Red once. Me and Red, we bet, I bet Red that he couldn't eat, I think it was three burgers. Yeah, three burgers. I, I bet Red that he couldn't eat three Big Macs in five minutes. And... The first one, he scoffed it right down. And the second one, he started slowing down. Oh, and, I, and he, he also tried to drink water. And I told him, you know, the bet was he couldn't drink any water. Any water, no sodas, any liquids. And about, I'll say about first couple of bites into that third one, his face started turning red and it was like his head was about to blow off. And I kept on, oh, man, he tried to stop. And Brad was like, man, now nah, we, man, you, you got to stop that. Man, nah, man, you got to bet out. Nah, man, a bet is a bet. So Red finally gave up, and I won the bet. It was a $500 bet. 
uh, stupid things that people do when they're young. So I know that they didn't, that brother is hurting like, I mean, he got to be hurting bad. Because I know for a fact he didn't think that his brother was going to drown. But this is why I tell my kids all the time, all the time, safety first. We have to think about these type of things. Like if we really love the people that we say we love and these people that we dare to do like things that we know that could pose some danger, some degree of danger, we have to make sure that we don't put them, them in these type of compromising positions where they could possibly lose their lives. Man, that's cold-blooded. R.I.P. J.W. Ransom. No more talk. What the haters talking about?